affair that left her bus hanging over the Mass Pike is trying to get her license back. News Center 5's Antoinette Antonio is live in Boston where a hearing just wrapped up. Antoinette? And Emily, the RMV is arguing that Shayna Shaw is unfit to drive and her license should remain suspended. We also learned new today that she is now accused of using her phone to listen to internet radio while she was behind the wheel of that bus crash. Shayna Shaw appearing before the Board of Appeals, trying to get her driver's license back. Shayna Shaw, S H A W. Those were the only words she spoke during the hearing. Counsel with the Registry of Motor Vehicles arguing Shaw's license should remain suspended, calling her a threat to public safety. The 43 year old's license was revoked after this crash in May when the bus she was driving crashed into a guardrail in Newton, leaving part of the bus dangling over the pike. Nine people on board were injured. Shaw faces obstruction of justice charges for lying to investigators about having her cell phone at the time of the crash. They say she later admitted to having it, and during today's hearing, we learned investigators found it was being used for Pandora, an internet radio service. One of those... The, the actual criminal charge for which she's been arraigned on, the judge has ordered that she not drive unless, unless the registry reinstates her license. I'm not going to overrule that judge's order. But Shaw's lawyer argues she's a mother of three. She's looking for a new job after being fired by the MBTA, and she needs her driver's license in order to get on with her life. She's suffering, and her family is suffering as a result. And Shaw's lawyer also argues that not having a driver's license has caused her to be turned away from jobs because she doesn't have transportation to get there. No decision was made today. That is expected in about 10 days. We're live in Boston. Antoinette Antonio, WCBB, News Center 5.